Hey, I'm William. Today I'm going to show you how to test the temperature selector switch on a GE dryer that only makes a low heat. The temperature selector switch lets you choose the desired setting for your dryer so your laundry gets dried at the right temperature. Before we get started, hit those like and subscribe buttons if you want to join our do-it-yourself repair community and get notified each time we post a new video guide. With over 2 million products in stock and the know-how to help you do it yourself, we are AppliancePartsPros.com. First, we need to get our tools together. Today, we'll need a multimeter and a Torx 20 driver. And please remember that safety comes first. Always disconnect your dryer by unplugging it or switching the breaker off. Now let's get started. Now we're gonna use our Torx 20 driver to remove the mounting screws along the top of the console and rotate the console forward. Now we need to set the selector to cotton or high heat and then remove the orange wire terminal 16 and the blue wire terminal 8. We can set our multimeter to continuity mode, which looks like a sideways Wi-Fi symbol, and use our multimeter probe to test from the orange wire at terminal 15 to the empty terminal at 16. There should be continuity here, so your meter will probably make a beeping sound. You shouldn't be getting continuity at any other terminal at this point. If you do, then you'll know that the temperature selector is bad. If you have continuity from terminal 15 to 16, but not to the other terminals, then we can set the selector to delicate or low heat. Now you can test from terminal 6 to the yellow wire at terminal 7. If there's continuity here, that means the selector switch is good and something else may be causing the problem. To put the dryer back together, rotate the console to the back panel. Now we'll secure it with the Torx 20 screws and we're done. Don't forget to plug the dryer back in or flip the circuit breaker back on. If your temperature selector switch is good, you can check out our other troubleshooting guides to find out what might be causing your dryer to only produce low heat. We've got thousands of videos to help you diagnose your appliances and make repairs. If your temperature selector switch is bad, you can order a replacement at AppliancePartsPros.com so you can repair it yourself. Make sure to let us know how the repair went in the comments. And if you like this video, let us know by hitting the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for your support, and we'll see you next time.